Welcome to the Hope for the Animals podcast, a project of compassionate living. I'm your host, Hope Bohannock, and this is a special short episode just for dedicated listeners. So we are at the end of the year here, and I wanted to reach out to you specifically, those listeners who appreciate this podcast, tune in regularly. I want to start by thanking you. I appreciate you so much, and I'm so glad that you love the show, that you tune in regularly. It makes all the hard work worth it. And I'm going to get right to the point, so you can turn this off if you want to. I want to ask you for your support to become a monthly donor to Compassionate Living. It was a tough year, and I've been trying to find funding sources to sustain all that we do at Compassionate Living, not only this podcast, but all our other projects, the Humane Hoax Project, the Ahimsa Living Project, and to be able to continue all that we do, one aspect that I think will really help going forward is building our monthly donors. The podcast is what takes the majority of my time. It's incredibly time-consuming to produce these episodes. So that's why I'm coming to you. You know how hard I work. You know that I try very hard to find great guests and to stay consistent with my releases and create a quality product. So I'm asking for your support. I don't use Patreon for a few reasons. One is that this podcast is a project of compassionate living. So all donations are tax deductible, and I want them to go through our nonprofit, Compassionate Living, and not go to me. And the other reason is that I don't like there to be a paywall for content. I want Compassionate Living's content to be available to everyone who wants to listen, no matter their financial situation or their commitment level. I have worked for animal rights nonprofits for over 20 years. I've had very little money, been a poor activist all that time. And I've always been frustrated when there was content that I was interested in that I wanted to hear, but you had to pay to get it. Like the bonus content on Patreon. That's kind of how Patreon works. You're supposed to kind of have bonus content for just those people. And I could never afford that. So I have said that I don't want to do that. I won't do that. I want our content to be free for everyone. But then to be able to do that, those that can need to help. So I ask you to consider becoming a monthly donor to Compassionate Living. Having monthly support helps us to have some kind of consistent income through the year. Uh, I've learned in the past couple of years that grants are really tough to get. And after jumping through very involved and time-consuming hoops, after all that, you just get rejected. It's very hard and very inconsistent. And you go through a lot of rigmarole and time and energy just to get rejected. So it would really help to supplement the unpredictable and unreliable nature of grants to have monthly supporters, uh, monthly supporters and donors. I'm learning that we are in a very difficult position to get grants, being grassroots, being vegan education, and not a big organization doing animal welfare campaigns or corporate campaigns. I mean, just being animal or vegan related limits the funds, you know, considerably. And then being grassroots and animal rights and vegan education limits it even further. In fact, the grassroots only gets 3% of every animal cause, animal related donation. So I need your support. The end of the year is coming. If you can't give monthly, perhaps you'll consider giving a one-time end of the year donation. That would be appreciated as well. You know, this podcast is a ton of time, a ton of energy, but I love doing it. It's very rewarding, and I'm very excited about the new batch of interviews for 2024. But if I can't secure some consistent funding, next year may be the last year for this podcast. So please, if you can, become a monthly donor to Compassionate Living. And I really feel like an NPR radio fundraising campaign right now. (laughs) But I, I hope that you can appreciate how grassroots and precious and special this podcast is, so much so that NPR would never play it. Because vegan issues just aren't seen as acceptable yet. 
not even to the progressive far left. I mean, that's why this kind of media, this podcast is so important. There are so few voices speaking for the animals. So please help me to continue this work. I'm asking you to dig deep, donate to Compassionate Living, make a donation and make it monthly. There's a way to set that up in our system. So it just comes out automatically. You don't have to do anything once it's set up. We will just let you know that the donation was made with an email and that's it. So I'm going to wrap up. That's it. I'm not going to take too much more of your time here. I just wanted to ask you for your support so I can continue this work, this work that is so important to me. And I know it is to you too. I take my responsibility to the animals very seriously, and I work very hard to do what I feel is effective and productive, and I feel that this grassroots education is critical to creating the compassionate vegan world that we all want to see. So please, please become a monthly donor to Compassionate Living. I'll have a link to our donation page in the show notes of this little bonus episode. So for the animals, live vegan and donate generously. Thank you.